This is a triple beam balance, and it measures mass. Mass is the amount of matter or stuff in any given object. It is always the same regardless of where you are in the universe. It never changes. Unlike weight, which changes based on gravity, all matter is going to have mass and it's not going to change from one place to another. There are multiple tools you can use to measure mass. These can be things such as electronic balances, double pan balances, or even, like in this case, a triple beam balance. In science class, we're going to be using these triple beam balances. There are six parts. This is the pan. The pan is where you place your object to be measured. You also have three beams. The first one measures in by ones, the middle beam measures by 100s, and the last beam, which measures by 10. These weights move along their beam at different notches to tell you how much mass there is within that object. It's because of these three beams that this is called a triple beam balance. As you move the weights along, you'll also notice that this line drops. The goal is to make it so that this line lines up with the zero over here. Once they're in line, the pan is now balanced with the weights and we can actually figure out how much mass there is in the object. But sometimes it gets a little messed up and your line doesn't line up. You'll notice that that my line here isn't exactly matching the zero. So this knob over here at the end can turn, which allows you to change where this line matches. This is known as zeroing or tearing. So the goal is to make it so that when nothing is on the pan, it lines up with zero. And those are the parts to a triple beam balance, which is used to measure mass.